Hey everyone, welcome to my Vogue Daily Motion channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to achieve my everyday glowy natural makeup look. Bye. Hi. The first thing I do is I mix two different foundations together, one darker, one lighter. I like to use a Maybelline Fit Me. I have a really dull complexion, so I need foundation. And honestly, I went a little bit too light, as I soon find out here. I and I'm pissed. Then I put on my Fit Me concealer. I don't use it all the time, but occasionally I do when I really need it. And I just put that everywhere, especially on areas which aren't really covered by the foundation. And I just, you know, I dab. I dab that hole in. Then I observe my face and get angry. And then I put more concealer on. And then I use the greatest powder ever. I've been using it ever since high school. It is a Laura Mercier dude. Don't be fooled. It looks like cocaine. And when I was at the airport when I was 18, people thought I was snorting cocaine, but I wasn't. <laughs> I love that song. The Great Gatsby album bangs. Anyway, then I do my whole contour. Um, I use my really old brush. If you've seen my other disgusting makeup routines, I use that brush there too. Then I do my nose contour and I don't do it very well. Oh my God. Hi. It looks really bad right now, but don't worry. We're going to blend. Here I am listening to the Great Gatsby soundtrack and I'm blending that hoe in. I love my baby. Hey baby, yeah, I love you. Stupid is what stupid do. Tom and Jerry, yeah, I love you. Iggy, buggy, biggy, bap, Come, baby, gonna lollipop. Bye. I'm just one night old guy. I'm just one night old guy. I ain't got time for you, baby. Thanks, Simone, for that little concert. Anyways, now I'm using the Charlotte Tilbury Pink Gasm blush. Thank you, Madison Beer, for recommending this. I've been waiting for about half a year and it really changed my entire makeup routine. It's expensive though. Here we go, ladies. You can't even see anything on camera. Now I'm using my e.l.f. Moonlight Highlighter. This highlighter is about $8. The greatest highlighter in the world and it lasts maybe two years or longer. I recommend it. Look at that glow. Look at that glow. I wish you could see more of that glow. Look at that glow. You can see the glow there. Look at the glow. Comment if you see the glow, because I do. Then I do my eyebrows and I'm using the Etude House eyebrow pencil. Quite frankly, my eyebrows go through like good weeks, bad weeks. I'm currently in a weird growth cycle, so they're very sparse and I also cut them. I shouldn't have done that, but yeah, I'm not the greatest at doing my eyebrows. They look different all the time. I'm yet to find a good routine for them. And even when I fill them in, they're still like very, very sparse and there is nothing I can do about it. I mean, you know what there probably is, but I don't know what to do about it. And you know what? It's good enough for me. It's good enough. They actually look pretty good here. Usually they don't look this good. Period. Now we are up to my long-awaited eyelash routine. I curl my lashes with the Shu Yumera, don't know how to pronounce it, eyelash curler. Greatest eye lash curler in the world, okay? You have to buy it and then we aren't going to talk about this. If you've seen my other makeup routines, you know why it looks like this. Basically, I use a brush from another product in the, in the Essence mascara because I like that product a lot more. Wow, I'm dead. Oh, look at that difference. Wow. Now I'm going to invite you to look at my nostrils, but really you should look at my eyelashes. Occasionally, I do like to wear brown eyeliner um, on my waterline, and I use the Estee Lauder Double Wear Eyeliner. This was a gift. I don't think I'd buy expensive eyeliner ever. Yeah, sometimes, like if I'm going out at night, I'll wear it. And 
in my videos, on the days where I look like I'm wearing more makeup, it's because of this. It makes all the difference. A lot of people have been apparently asking me for my lip routine, and apparently they really like my lip color, but apparently this girl right here uses a lot of different colors on her lips, so I can't actually tell you what I use because as you will see, I usually combine like three different lip products together, but I'm gonna leave them all on the screen. They're all from They're all around two dollars. Please don't go and sell them out because every time I go buy a lip liner from Essence, they're sold out. Thank you, TikTok. <laughs> Then I blend that in. So far we've used a nudie pink, we've used a brown, and we've used a red. And to top it all off, I always use my Navia Strawberry Lip Balm over the top. It just blends all of the colors to together and leaves a very lovely look on my lips. Beautiful, kissable. Moisturized, mwah. Then I get my eyeshadow palette, and I have another one which I use. Sometimes I like to use the Morphe one, but there's too many colors and it genuinely overwhelms me. So I use this little cheap palette and I get some, okay. And I, <laughs> I get some gold. You can't see anything on the camera, but I like to put the gold in the inner corners and at the start. And then at the end, I get the two browns. I mix that up and I put them at the end. And yeah, you can't really see anything at all in this lighting. Oh, okay. My lip gloss very requested i'm using the morphe one today it's a lip gel lip oil it's a lip oil oh i hate this voiceover okay then i put in my beauty marks going back to the lip gloss i usually use the red one it will set your lips on fire okay now we're finished beautiful natural glowy elegant natural beautiful glowy elegant beautiful fabulous darling oh my god i need to like get a theosaurus i can't think of any more words gorgeous stunning oh my god i can't think of any more bellissimo fuego on punto <laughs> thank you for watching my voiceover hi bye of people love each other the world would be a better place to live. Roman, Roman, vacacion. Mi hada madrina dijo que sí. Este de aquí me hizo llorar. Este otro me dice marica. Este otro de mí piensa mal. Esto es lo que hago cuando me chingan. And before I go, I just want to say it matters not what you've done, but what you do with what you've done for others.